Here at WCA, we want to honor people doing amazing things in the community. That's why we've came up with a segment called Everyday Heroes. The first is about a Central Illinois man who served in one of the most dangerous areas and one of the most deadly jobs during World War II. And he just turned 100 years old. If you drive by the small town of Gilman, you might miss it. But if you look close enough, you'll find a man who's lived a life documented in our history books. When I went overseas, uh, it was kind of scary. Meet Max Howard, a former World War II naval aviator. I uh, didn't get hurt, but I lost a lot of good friends. Howard was part of bombing runs in the Pacific. I was, had machine guns to keep the enemy away. His official title, bombardier. It's quite an honor, uh, I think, to be uh, the bombardier. Back, but when the pilot dropped the bomb, it, it was in an old SBD Dauntless. Uh, the pilot myself. Now don't let the 99-year-old highly decorated veteran's age fool you. What's kept you going this long? That, I don't know. <laughs> Boy, I never dreamed I'd be 100 years old. Even at 100, Howard still has his sharp wit and sense of humor. I'm a beer drinker. <laughs> <laughs> I have a beer about every time I have a meal. meal. It's good. Keeping detailed records of everything he did overseas. Very good note taker. The journal he has here is very complete with days and events. Not only has Max served our country, he's been a pillar in the small Iroquois County community working in banking, giving out loans for years before retiring. He's well regarded and highly regarded with the citizens of the community, I think, because um, he's just... I think you give people a chance. And if you ask his secret to making it to 100... I don't try and keep it a secret. <laughs> I try to get somebody that likes beer, too. <laughs> now the city of Gilman helps Max celebrate his birthday by throwing him a parade. He also wanted me to share that he is one of our longest viewers. So cheers to you, Max, and happy belated birthday. If you'd like to submit an idea, you can message me on Facebook at Brandon Morano TV right here at the bottom of your screen.